Hey everyone, Val here, and I'm with Steve, and we are on our way to Bedford, Virginia, and we are meeting up with Chris and Leah. Um, as you know, our friends that we met on YouTube, and we have been friends with them ever since. So we decided today we would meet halfway. They live in North Carolina. We're in Virginia. It's about a four-hour drive, so we're going two and a half hours south, and we're going to meet them in Bedford, and we're going to have breakfast, and we should be there around 10 a.m. So then we're going to, I think, explore a couple of museums or something. So we're going to head out. We'll take you along and uh, let's have a fun day. Are you ready? Use Chris and Leah again. I don't remember. Some kind of weird people. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. All right. See you in a bit. It didn't work. Let's go over. I don't know if it worked. Oh, here we go. Hey, we're at Fisher's Restaurant and I'm with Leah. <laughs> and we're eating breakfast and the guys are over there and then we're going to go exploring. We're in Bedford, Virginia. So we're sitting at this wall and it's a, dedicated to this Marine. He's currently 92 years old and what did you say his name was? Dan, Dan Burial. And uh, he actually was here and he was getting ready to leave as we were pulling in and uh, we got to speak with him. It was very cool, but he has a whole wall to himself. So this is what he looks like, and he is currently 92 years old. Very, very awesome. So um, this is what we're eating, and Leah got some eggs and a biscuit with some ham, and Chris is eating eggs and hash browns and Steve's picking at his food because they put onions in his hash browns no, oh they switched hash browns all right and then I have an egg and uh, omelet and I'm supposed to get some hash browns and some bacon with coffee yes please we are at the Bedford Welcome Center I guess we are gonna go in here and see what we need to do to get into the museums and stuff so we'll go pick up some literature let's check it out It's a really cool fire truck. Check it out, you dizzy. Very cool. I like that. The fire hose just kind of wraps up there, I guess. All right. Okay, you'll stay in the state. This is our English garden. Look on the wall over there, you see a shield. Now look at the garden. The garden's in the shape of the shield. See the sword? And then the rainbow is the flowers. So if you're looking at this garden from above, it's shaped like this. And this is called a shape patch. Shape stands for Supreme Headquarters of the Allied Expeditionary Forces. And this patch was worn on the sleeve of those in You will see a map. Yeah, we're all coming to this. This is the map of the landing plans for D-Day. Okay? 
The black at the top is English. The blue is the English Channel, which they crossed, landing in the morning on nine different beaches, beginning at six. This wall and that wall contain the names of the 4,415 men who died on the day. Mm. The Americans were on this west wall. It was 2,502. The other allies were on the east wall. It was 1,900. I'm so sorry. You're fine. This is why they couldn't go and, low, and had to go to low tide. I want to hit those. <laughs> babies. In the fall of 2019, we got on a little hopper, took her back to Liberty, and restored her to absolute knit condition. So she's ready for another 20 years. We also found out at the last minute. There's open. Behind you. Look at the mountains. The blue red carpet. Mm -hmm. The two peaks are the peaks of honor. And there's a lot of them. Nice. Oh, you said, oh, did you? Yeah. <laughs> it's about a 20 minute drive uh, from here. Beautiful drive on a day like today. And you'd have lunch or dinner. Alright, we had fun at the museum. Now we are at, where are we at? Liberty Station. Liberty Station. We're still in Bedford. So uh, we're having, and we just walked 20 miles uphill. Yes, backwards in the snow. <laughs> so uh, we're having lunch dinner. So this is the first course. Steve got onion rings. Steve got onion rings for us to, to share. So we're going to have some onion rings. Are you having a good day? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. <laughs> How about you? <laughs> Not exactly a vote of confidence, was it? <laughs> It's a great day. Simply fantastic. <laughs> How about you? I'm having a good day, as long as I keep eating. <laughs> All right, let us eat. Okay, we have got served a bread and a crock. It's a, it's a crock of bread. There you go. Somebody try it and see if it's any good. Steve's going to give it a try. It's Bavarian. Do you want, it's Bavarian bread? What's the, de, what's the, uh, song? Here's me 10 years from now. Is it like honey butter? It's honey cinnamon or something. Ooh, is that what's sounds good. Tastes, like? tastes good. Tastes like bread? It all tastes good. That's it. All right. Steve gives it the thumbs up. It's got to be good wanted to talk. She was lonely. Alright, so here's our food. I got the uh, crab salad. Steve got a burger and fries. Chris got a burger and fries with mushrooms, which is awesome looking. And what'd you get? A panini. Panini with chicken. Chicken panini. Yeah. Alright, that's our lunch. Dinner. Dinner. Lunch dinner. That's our dinner. Dinner. <laughs>
Well, we, had, we had a brunch. Alright, so we are on our way home. We just stopped at the gas station. Steve went inside. Um, but we are on our way back home. We should be home about 8.30 probably. Um, we had a fun day today. Um, good to see the uh, Chris and Lee again. We haven't seen them in a while. But uh, it, we had a fun time. So thank you all for hanging out with us. Give us a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not subscribed and you want to. And I will catch you on the next adventure. Bye now.